What's up, Clemson Nation? What's up, TTC? Clemson versus Florida State. This is the ACC championship every year. That's just the way it is. The game in Charlotte is just a normally an exhibition match, except for last year. Georgia Tech actually almost did beat Florida State. But uh, other than that, it's been blowouts, I'm pretty sure. Clemson and Florida State. Clemson comes in ranked number one. Guys, I did not even want to be ranked number one. All right, it's all it's awesome, but at the same time, it, I don't think it's going to take away from the focus of this team. Maybe it'll even give us some more motivation. I don't know, but it is what it is. We're number one right now. Twice, twice since 2000, Clemson has started 8-0. And twice since 2000, Clemson lost that next game. We've not been 9-0, uh, I don't think, since the championship year. Maybe we were like 9-0-1 or something, one of the other years. But it's it's this is the game. This is the game. That number one ranking, it does not mean a thing. This is the game that will put us over the top. Florida State might be down this year. This is not the Florida State team, even of last year. And last year's Florida State team wasn't great. Uh, it's not even. It's just a fragment of what the 2013 Florida State team was. And Clemson is a good bit better than this team. We're just simply better. Uh, that's just the way it is this year. We're just a better team. Uh, Florida State's only loss was a fluke loss, but they didn't have any business. Georgia Tech's two and six. They didn't have any business being in that game anyway. So I haven't been impressed at all by Florida State this year. Uh, obviously, Cook was good, but he's, you know, got his issues going on right now. And we don't even know who's – I haven't even checked. I don't even know if Dolson's going to start him with uh, McGuire. But either way, I, I think we've just – we're just too much better than Florida State this year for it to be a problem. Uh, this game, we get past this. Obviously, we win the Atlantic with a win. Uh, we get to the championship game 9-0, and there's nobody else on our schedule who – has got the talent to even to even compete with us. Uh, South Carolina might hang in it for a half, but I'm pretty sure we're just going to hit them early and end it. Florida State comes in solid, solid defense. You know, the offense is just not what it was last year. Just that simple. Uh, they squeaked by Wake Forest. Uh, they squeaked by. Uh, obviously, they lost to Georgia Tech. Just not impressed. They just have not been impressive. There's no other way to really put it. Squeaked by Miami at home. You saw what we did to Miami. Uh, they also they've obviously got talent. They've obviously got talent places, but it's just not adding up right now. You know they they just don't have everything clicking right now, like Clemson does. Clemson has everything clicking. Also, after Clemson wins this game, you know. People are going to be talking about the strength of schedule. That doesn't determine how good a team is. Look what Ohio State did. Look what we've done the last few years in the postseason, okay? Other than the West Virginia game, we've been magnificent in the postseason uh, since 2011. Uh, you know, the ACC championship destroyed number five Virginia Tech, uh, beat the best LSU team the last three years in 2012, uh, beat uh, Ohio State, obviously, and we beat Oklahoma wasn't great last year, but we absolutely obliterated them with Cole Stout. So it is what it is. I, I love these conversations about how Clemson, uh, ACC, ACC, this. It doesn't matter. We're better than your team. We're better than whoever you want to put up against us. We can beat anybody in the country. There's, I, I love hearing it from these SEC homers and these Gamecock fans. Come play our schedule. Guys, you play in the East. Okay? Look, Missouri came in there, a mid-major Big 12 school came in and won it back to back. If you honestly think Clemson couldn't win the East, you're literally just smoking tons of marijuana. You're covered, just covered with garnet glasses, red, black glasses, whatever team you're supporting. Uh, Clemson would win the East this year. I'm sorry. That's just fact. Uh, the West would be a different story. The West is the toughest division in college football, and I'm not even going to argue with that. The West would be a very, very, very tough division to win. If you're from the East, just keep your mouth shut. For God's sake, keep your mouth shut. Um, we can we can compete with anybody in the country. That's just the way it is this year. We are possibly the best team in the nation, but nothing, nothing, nothing matters until we beat Florida State Saturday. Not a, not one thing. Because if we lose that game, everything that we've been working for and working towards is gone. And it's just going to be another season like the last few. A good season 
not a fantastic elite season. We have to beat Florida State if we want to get put up on the elite map. We have to get to the playoffs if we want to get put up on the elite program's map. It's just that simple. We've been a very good program lately, but we haven't taken the next step yet. And that starts Saturday. It starts Saturday. This is possibly the biggest game in Clemson history because it's that big of a step. It's that big of just a hump that we have to get over. Haven't beat Florida State since 2011, the last time we won the ACC. It has to happen. Last year, it was just ridiculous the way we lost that game. We've lost to Florida State two worst possible ways you can lose to somebody in the last two years. We lost in a blowout fashion at home, and we outplayed the heck out of them last year and just gave it away late. And those, those are just the most painful losses you can have. We have to beat Florida State. There's nobody. I don't care. Just nobody. I don't care. A lot of Clemson fans will say South Carolina. Forget South Carolina. There's nobody I'd rather be in the country than Florida State. And Saturday, that happens. Finally, we get over this hump. And then that number one ranking will actually mean something to me, okay? Then we can start talking about the playoffs. None of that matters until we beat Florida State. Go Tigers!